startling sounds. That's the gunfire that killed a woman at the Glenwood Community Center in the hilltop yesterday and sent two teens to the hospital. And once again, we in Columbus are fearful and frustrated by another deadly shooting at a place that's supposed to be safe for everyone. Tonight, we're learning more about the shooting and the woman who was killed. Kate Seifert spoke with her family. She's live at CPD headquarters. Kate. Bob Stacia, we heard from Atea Nichols' mother tonight. She tells us her daughter was a beautiful soul. And on a GoFundMe page in honor of Atea, her family said that her laughter would light up any room and her love for her family and friends was unconditional. She was just 24 years old. Atea's mom sharing these photos with us on Thursday, telling us her daughter was a volunteer cheerleading coach and a great mother. Atea was among three people shot at the community center on Wednesday. The two other victims, an 18 and 15 year old, were taken to the hospital in critical condition. The sound of screams echoing across the rec center parking lot after shots were fired. There isn't a suspect in custody, but police tell us they are working on several leads. This is the fourth deadly shooting at a Columbus Park since April. On Thursday, Mayor Andrew Ginther meeting with the staff at Glenwood Community Center, but behind closed doors. The meeting only lasted about 30 minutes. We weren't a lot in the room, and the employees were told they were not able to talk to us afterwards. We weren't able to share anything with the mayor said. No. All right, thank you. Wednesday shooting is the second deadly tragedy in the hilltop this week. On Tuesday, a 14 year old was stabbed and killed along North Ogden Avenue. Police tell us that stemmed from an ongoing fight amongst young kids. Live on your side outside CPD headquarters, I'm Kate C for Fox 28 News. Kate, thank you. Now we mentioned that meeting with Mayor Ginther. Violent crime and murders are up since Ginther took office. Michael Coleman's last year saw 100 murders. Ginther had an initial spike in 2017, and then it calmed down some, then spiked again in 2020, 2021. Population in the city is up about 7% since 2015. Murders are up 105% after last year.